There are two strategies that topoisomerases use to do this. One is to break one of the strands of DNA, to pass the intact strand through the breakpoint, and then to reseal the strand. The other uses a break in a DNA strand followed by a rotation around the strands to relieve the unwinding and resealing the breakpoint. The two of these have an equivalent impact, that is, they both release the torsional stress from unwinding. We also see roles for topoisomerases outside of replication. In some cases, DNA can become supercoiled. This drawing depicts a circular piece of DNA supercoiled on the left. Treating that with a topoisomerase relaxes it to circular DNA. Sometimes DNA is formed where two circular pieces of DNA pass through each other. These are called catenated rings. Treating these with topoisomerases can allow the rings to become separated from each other. On the right, you can see the structure of topoisomerase surrounding DNA, protecting DNA during the process. This is important because a mistake in topoisomerase results in a break in DNA. So a substantial part of this protein, of its structure, stabilizes DNA during this process.